little guinea pig right here is in need of a sub-Q injection. So sometimes we send home antibiotics that need to be given underneath the skin. And so when we're doing that, we wanna make sure, number one, that, it's, that you guys feel comfortable, but also that it's safe for these little guys. When we're giving injections under the skin, you want to kind of pinch up on the skin right around the shoulder area, so kind of right here. So the skin area that you want to pinch up on is right here along the shoulders. And so we're just going to give a little pinch up on the skin here. When you do that, you're almost creating like a teepee of skin. Um, and so you want to kind of, when, when you're giving the injection, you want to put the injection inside the teepee of skin. Sometimes when you're doing these types of injections, it's good to have distractions as well. So either a friend to help you, or as Zach is doing, eating some really good food here. So once you're ready, you have your medications drawn up in your syringe. You're gonna take the needle off very carefully, and then you're gonna pinch up in that shoulder area. So we're just gonna give a pinch on the skin right here. And then we're going to inject right into our little teepee. So right in all the way, and you'll feel a little bit of a give once you're through the skin. The way that you make sure that you're in, in the skin or underneath the skin is by pulling back on your syringe so that you get negative pressure. So when I let go, there's no air. It goes right back to where it was. So now I know that I'm underneath the skin. And you can give the injection. So he did great. And we're just going to pull the needle out and gently recap it. Make sure that there's no leaking of that medication in the area that you gave it. If there is any leaking, you can take a little bit of a Kleenex or a paper towel and kind of wipe that down to make sure that none of the medication is on the fur where he might be able to lick it off or ingest it.